Hi, I'm Lucas. I'm a project manager, and I used to use Notepad++, but I switched to Microsoft Visual Studio Code. For more reviews of this, click the link below. As a project manager, I work with a number of websites and projects that require me to look into some code or just simply use a plain text editor when I can't use Microsoft Word. And so, while I'm not a web developer, I do, on a regular basis, use plain text editors and code editors to facilitate my projects. So Microsoft Visual Studio Code is great for people who love a product that's really baked into the Microsoft system, baked into PowerShell, and works well with Microsoft's other um, editing code editing projects. Product. It's also really great for someone who just you need your app to look good when you load it. You don't have to mess with it a lot. It'll just look good. Even guess at uh, what software language you're using and display the code accordingly. The Notepad++ is a great text editor for people who care about open source, who want to use something that's produced by small independent software uh, providers and not tied into a big uh, software company like Microsoft. Notepad++ is really fast, it loads quickly, and it's great for people who love to customize to their heart's content. It's pretty easy to just get started using both of these software, uh, both of these apps. But with Notepad++, if you want to back up your projects and so forth, you have to do a little more fiddling with the settings. It is open source, and so to make it look good, to make it act like you want, you have to, to learn the software a little more than you do with Visual Studio Code. So all in all, it's easier to get started with Visual Studio Code because out of the box it just looks good and works well. When you're looking for a text editor or a code writer or editor, it's obviously important to think about what you're going to be use it, using it for and what kind of a user you are. If you're a power user and you love to customize, that'll influence which app you use. And you might want to go with something like Notepad++. But if you want something that's just going to be there when you need it and work well and you don't have to worry about it, then you might choose something that's more out-of-the-box, reliable, like Microsoft Visual Studio Code.